This is Uncle Momo's Music Reaction Channel where I provide my views on talented artists from around the world, both established artists and non-established artists. And I promise you that you won't be disappointed whatsoever. So why don't you come and join me in discovering amazing, talented artists and bringing it to the forefront of my channel for us to view. Now, my next reaction of today, we are going over to Indonesia. This is my second reaction of an Indonesian artist of today. Please check out Anastasia. That was my first reaction. She's singing live on the Roommate Project. See you on Wednesday. Your uh, support is truly appreciated in support supporting me reacting to Indonesian artists. So please check out her Anastasia. She has got the most amazing texture of low frequency vocals to falsetta. It's so smoothing, it really is. And it's a soul vibe as well. So please check her out. I'll leave the um, the link to Anastasia's after this, um, you know, the thumbnail link. So be sure after this reaction, just click onto that thumbnail and it'll take you straight over to my next in uh, Indonesian artist. Now this particular artist, um, Happier, I mean, sorry, uh, Putriani, um, of course, <laughs> she's carrying out a song cover from Olivia Rodrigo's um, songs. It's called Happier and she's going to be playing that on the piano. I still have yet to see her play the flute. So where do I find that? Let me know. I want to see her play the flute. I understand she can play the flute. I want to see it. <laughs> Simple as that. Um, she's got the lyrical contents in there, but I'm not going to read it out to you. Why? Because you're going to hear it. She's going to sing it. If she was going to sing in another language and the lyrical contents was there, I would have translated it and put it in English. It's as simple as that. So look, I'm going to go straight into my next reaction of today. But before that, if this is your first time coming over to my channel, please subscribe. And don't forget to hit the notification button to indicate to you when my next uploads will be. Now, without further ado, you know what we're here for. Great vocabs and a damn good video audio music. Can you do good? You know what I'm about. We broke up a month ago. Your friends are mine, you know. She actually adapted to the song as in changing her vocals. Thanks. Completely different from Adele's song, Easy On Me. And I thought my heart was the time. Different from the human rhapsody. All the sunlight of our past. But she's so sweet. I have to stop because I don't want to talk over her. So apologies for that. So you've got that kind of unchained melody and riff. Dun, 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 Classic. It goes back to way back, way back into the 60s, 50s, I think, that, that melody. And like I said, her vocals has certainly changed. She's put a different kind of, uh, she's adapted to the actual song. So I don't know if she's done the research on the actual artist or the research on the actual song. Um, but she has clearly adapted. Her vocal texture is completely different from Beh Behemoth Raspidi. It's completely different from the Al um, Adele song that she covered on Easy On Me. And what I'm seeing is that it's almost that she's identified the texture of the artist and not kind of copied it, but sort of like used that as a benchmark reference to sing along. And no doubt she's going to put a footmark on it and, you know, deliver what she wants to deliver in her way. Um, but I feel that's going to be towards the end. Like she always, like any other artist will do if they want to put their footmark on it. But I'm just watching the the research vocals. That's what I'm called, talking about. It's not like you just hear a song and you're going to sing it. She's researched the, the artist, the vocal, the way how they're singing it, the textures that she's putting, they're putting on it. And she's mastered it. And now she's, put, now she's portraying her version of it. 
It's not just, oh, I've just listened to this song and now I know the words, I'm going to sing it out. No, there's much, much more to that. And But she's making it seem so effortless in the way of her design. So I really, really love this song. Um, I love what she's doing to it. And I love the way how she, more importantly, the way how she's making me feel when she's singing this song. I'm going to go back just a little bit, like little, little, little bit. See, I couldn't have said that um, during her, while she's singing. No way. Listen to every single word. Listen to my heart, I swear. So that was Putri Ariani, uh, Ariani, sorry, with um, Olivia Rodriguez um, cover Happier. Mm, wow, I thought like you're not gonna top Bohemian uh, Raspberry. I thought no, you're not gonna top that. Then she comes with an Adele Easy on me. I thought there's no way you're gonna top Adele Easy on me. Then she comes with this Happier. It's like three amazing different kind of textures from one artist. You can see the vocal capabilities. You can see the array of sporadic choices that she has within choices of terms of texture, terms of riffs, terms of um, 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 vibratus. She's got it all in the bag. And then she plays it with the piano and then you're just silent listen to all these amazing textures in different kind of combinations which you don't even know when it's going to come because it's so unpredictable so it leaves you like falling like this and following her like like you're the snake charm in the basket you know you're the snake in the chart you know the snake in the basket and and she's the the instrument that's like you know playing that song and you're you know you're like this and you're relying on every single note that's coming out from her mouth and so how angelic it is Right about now, like I've said before um, with Roland Ab um, Abante, is that you've got a massive wide platform and the song choices that you use on America's Got Talent is going to be so critical because America is a hungry country. If you're good, they want to know what the next thing is, what the next thing is, what the next thing is, and dry you out completely which you have no control of. They're just hungry. And, you're, and once you're under demand, that's when you're going to like, you know, you've got to be on your A game because as soon as you're like, as soon as they don't like you, whoosh, you're out. There's not even no slowdown. There's a drop and on, they're onto the next artist or the next best thing. So it's got to be carefully constructed. You just, it's not only about having a great voice on Americans Got Talent because you can see so many great voices. It's now the song, it's the song, um, 
uh, selection, is your execution, is your deliverance, is how the crowd is going to interact with you. And so far, she's ticking all the right boxes. So I can't wait for her to sing her second song. I can't wait to react to another cover. Until then, I salute you. Boom! I hope you're happy Just not like how you were with me I'm selfish, I know I can't let you go So find someone great, but don't find